Welcome to Bite Further. Today's video is about how to fix iPhone XR that won't turn on. When your iPhone XR won't turn on, you might run into the following issues. You can't turn on iPhone XR and it's not responding to anything or doesn't boot back up with a power button. Your iPhone XR suddenly turn off and won't turn back on at all. You might see iPhone XR not turning on after doing a software update. Your iPhone XR will not turn on even after charging for a long time like 3 to 4 hours. So, why does your iPhone XR shut off and won't turn back on or respond? First, check if there's any physical damage on the surface of your iPhone XR. Try to remind yourself if you have ever replaced the screen, dropped it into the water, and broken down the device on the floor. If your iPhone XR is in good condition regarding the hardware, the iPhone XR not turning on black screen issue should be related to the crashed software firmware. A battery running out of power is also one of the most obvious reasons why your device would no longer turn on. There are also other bugs or mistakes like unknown system bugs, malware attacks, failed update software, and so on. Next, we'll show you how to fix an iPhone XR that won't turn on at all. First of all, if your iPhone XR won't turn on after battery died, plug your unresponsive device into power and let it charge for more than 30 minutes. A drained battery usually causes your iPhone XR not to turn back on. That's because, to power on your iPhone XR, the battery needs enough power. If this is the case, charging the device can easily switch it on and fix the not turning on issue. Please use the charger and cable that came with your iPhone XR or the ones that are certified by Apple. It'd be better to charge your not turning on iPhone XR with a wall outlet rather than the computer USB port. When charging, you should see the charging symbol, a red battery charging icon, showing up on the black screen and your device will then restart automatically and boots up to the home screen. If your iPhone XR is charging but not turning on itself, force your device to turn on. This fix is also useful if your iPhone XR is not turning on or charging, which is stuck on a black screen and won't respond. You'll need to do that by pressing three buttons. Press the volume up button once. Press the volume down button once. Press the side button on the right and hold it for a while until you see the Apple logo on the screen. Now, keep your iPhone XR charging, and let's do it. Volume up button, volume down button, and holding the side button for 10 to 20 seconds until the Apple logo shows up on the screen. Okay, now you see the Apple logo. Let go of the button, and your iPhone XR turns on now. It should work normally and respond to your touch as before. If your iPhone XR still won't turn on after hard reset and is still not responding, the next solution is to update the iOS software. Here you'll need a computer and download iTunes or Finder application on your computer to turn on your iPhone XR. Alright, use a USB cable to connect your iPhone XR that's not turning on to the computer. Both laptop and desktop are OK. Then, download and open iTunes software. If you're using a Mac computer running macOS Catalina 15.10 or later version, just run Finder. Let's go back to your iPhone XR that can't turn on. To enable the device to connect to iTunes or Finder and do an update, you'll need to put it into recovery mode. This is easy to do and you won't lose anything in this step. Press the volume up button once, press the volume down button once, and then hold down the side button for 20 to 30 seconds until you see the recovery mode screen. That is a screen displaying a cable pointing to the computer. Let's do it. Volume up button, volume down button, and keep holding the side button. Don't let the side button go even when you see the Apple logo. Still hold it. Now, the recovery mode screen appears. Release the button and iTunes or Finder will quickly detect your device and pops up a dialog box. Okay, just like this. It's asking you if you need to update or restore the device. Choose the update button. Complete the on-screen steps and it'll download the latest iOS software firmware into your iPhone XR and let it boot back up. Wait patiently because it might take a few hours to finish depending on your internet speed. Okay, it's done and your iPhone XR is restarting. A few seconds later, your iPhone XR will successfully boot up into the lock screen or home screen. If you forgot the iPhone lock screen passcode and it shows iPhone unavailable screen after the update, click the card in the top right corner to see how to fix it up. If the update fails, your last resort is to restore the device. Keep your iPhone XR connected to iTunes or Finder and then enter recovery mode again. In the popping up message box, you'll need to choose restore. 
Note that it'll clear away everything on your phone and bring it back to factory settings. If you've backed up the content before, you can get data back after the restore. Now, click restore and complete the on-screen steps. It'll then completely reset your iPhone XR and turn it back on the Hello screen. That's all how to fix iPhone X not turning on or responding issues. Hope this video can help you power up the unresponsive device. If it does, please give it a thumbs up and share it via Facebook, Twitter, and so on to help others in need. Also, if you have any further questions, feel free to write them down in the comments below and I'll reply ASAP. To learn more tech tips about iPhones, subscribe to the Byte Further channel. Now, you can click another video on the screen to keep watching.